This video will teach you the OMM technique known as the prone thoracic parallel stretch. This technique is used to elongate the fascia restrictions in the longitudinal plane. Longitudinal meaning parallel with the spine of the patient. Hence the name prone thoracic parallel stretch. To do this, you'll stand on the opposite side of the side that you're treating. So I'm standing on the left side because I'm treating the patient's right and you use both hands. You want to place your hands back to back, so turn one uh, opposite to the other, and you work just in the paravertebral musculature, just lateral to the patient's spinous processes. Again, those spinous processes are the bumps you feel along the midline of the patient's back. You want to move just lateral to that, and now you're working in the paravertebral musculature and the uh, longitudinal fascial planes of the patient. So like I said, take your hands, turn them back to back, and you want to make sure that when they're back to back, they are not overlapping. Because if they're overlapping, when you do this to your patient, you're going to end up twisting that skin, twisting that uh, musculature, and it's going to feel a lot like a snake bite on your arm, if you're familiar with that feeling. So you want to make sure that your hands are further apart and there's no overlapping between your two uh, uh, palms or your two bases of your hands, for lack of a better term. So you work up and down the patient's spine, particularly in the thoracic region because this is the prone thoracic parallel stretch. And you'll just work out and pull your hands. Put your hands down in the tissue and then pull them apart. You can switch up which hand is closer to the spine. Just really make sure they're not overlapping because that can be quite painful for your patient. And you want to hold this push for about three seconds. I'm doing a little bit too fast right now. But you're really feeling for that fascial release and that longitudinal plane. Work up and down the spine, maybe even a little bit more laterally, but you really want to return back to that space just lateral to the uh, spinous processes, that paravertebral musculature. And you're really working with your palms or the base of your hands. Feet our eminence, base of your thumb. You want to do each stretch for about three seconds, really trying to free up that musculature. And again, this is the prone thoracic parallel stretch.